What's up, good people? Your boy Rashid Williams here. I'm here at Drumio with my friends, man, and we're having some great fun playing drums, which is what I love to do. So I'm in here, and Dave decides that he wants to give me a challenge today. Thanks a lot, Dave. And the challenge is to play a song I've never heard before. So we figure it'll be really fun. You all can watch how I like just interpret it, how I learn it, and I promise you I've never heard this track before. So it's a track called, hold on, My Guy, and it's just a track that Dave picked. So if you don't like the track, talk to Dave. No, it's gonna be great. So uh, I'm gonna start the process, and I'm gonna walk you all through how this all works. I'm a little nervous. Bear with me. Here we go. My Guy. So, first time ever, let's hit play. Yeah. Okay. Mm. I feel I'm so attracted. Okay, so immediately, this to me is a trap vibe. Um, I'm guessing that that beginning part is just an intro. So it wouldn't be any drums there, in my opinion. So this is how I would process it. I take each section, and I learn section by section. So far, the intro section, first section to learn. There's no drums there for me. I'm going to sit that part out. I'll tell you guys ahead of time. So the verse sounded like it was about to come in, I think. So let's play it and see. I feel I'm so attracted. Okay, verse. Follow them everywhere. I think I'm love drunk Off in another planet Yeah Oh mm. I'm feeling so attracted okay. I don't know why Follow them everywhere Like I'm a spy I think I'm love drunk Natural high off in another plane, up in the sky, yeah, be my type of guy, oh, be my type of guy, mm, be my type of guy, yeah, oh, mm, be my type of guy, I'm feeling so attracted, follow them everywhere. Okay, so the horns came in, I'm gonna call that the chorus, so far from what I hear. There's the intro, there's that first verse section where the vocals come in, and that section isn't as built up, so I'm going to assume that that would be the verse. And then uh, for the section where the horns come in, it kind of builds up a little bit. I'm going to say, because it's also like a background vocal that drops in there with the auto-tune, I'm going to say that that's the chorus, and then I think the verse just came back in. So, so far, that's what I got. I think I'm love drunk. Off in another planet. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Mm. Yeah. Oh. Mm. I'm feeling so attracted. I don't know why. Chorus again. I'm everywhere. Like I'm a spy. Yep. I think I'm love drunk. Natural high. Off in another planet. Up in the sky. Yeah, you my type of guy. Oh, you my type of guy. Mm. You my type of guy. Yeah, oh, mm. you my type of guy. You my type of guy. Oh, okay. You my type of guy. Okay, so from what I got now, okay, we got the intro, we got the verse comes in, there's a section where the vocals drop out right before the first chorus, and then the chorus comes in. After that, we have another verse, another chorus, and then the ending is like vamping out just on that chorus, but not the full chorus. So this time, play it again. And I'm going to basically take what I just heard, start to kind of put some drums on top of it. I'm going to use some of the 
Because it says trap to me, I'm going to use some of the trap rules. The kick will go with the bass. Boom. Yeah, so I'm going to see if I can work it out and we'll go through it. And then hopefully I can wow Dave. And by the time I listen to this again, I'll be playing it straight through. So let's do like a trial run, which is what I normally do. Just to see, you know, fill the sections and kind of come up with some cool things to add and take away. Yeah. Mm. I feel I'm so attracted. Follow him everywhere. I think I'm love drunk. Off in another planet. Yeah. First time, not too bad. However, what I noticed, I think the open hi-hats are a little too much for that one section. Uh, so, which is always a thing, like uh, evaluating it. So I think what's best is that the intro stays the same. When I come in, the... Maybe cut down the hi-hat activity just a little bit. And then for the choruses, take it up without the open hi-hats. then save the open hi-hats for that very last section after the second chorus because that's like the end of the song that should be the biggest and I think I might be able to wow Dave this might happen today I'm thinking so all right I'm gonna try that this time and see what it feels like I think it'll feel a whole lot better kind of trying to take some of the trap rules and and put them into some of the hip-hop rules and Make it all one big thing. So let's see what happens. We're gonna do this again. Yeah. Mm. I feel I'm so attracted. Oh. 
So, there's that. However, there's one more part to this. There's something I heard, and while I do have the song, fine tuning is everything. So, there's a spot coming out of the second verse, going into the next section where there's a slight like push, a little delayed push. I want to catch that. I'm gonna play this one more time. I'm gonna see if I can catch that spot because I think it would add to the music a lot. So let's dig into that. Actually, I'll do one better. I'm gonna play it just to make sure I have it, like just from a middle spot. And then we'll go through it. I'll play it one more time and I'll have it down. I'll impress Dave. Here we go. I think it was somewhere around the second verse. It comes in with a little push. Yeah. Oh. Right. I'm feeling so attracted. Follow them everywhere. I think I'm love drunk. Off in another planet. Yeah. There it is. Okay. So. In my process of learning, what this will be called is going back to get the minor details that make a major difference. So I want to catch that hit. Uh, so let's play it one more time for a little bit before it. Cool. I think I got it. Uh, let's go from the top. Yeah. Yeah. 
in and never